What's going on, everybody? My name's Chris, and welcome back to some more episodes of, or episode of Ocarina of Time. Let's play. Uh, in the last episode, we started the Water Temple. It was very famous for being watery and temple-y and stuff, and probably as well as some things. And, um, we saw Princess Naruto, and it was kind of disgusting, actually. Like, why is, she, why is she here? I don't know. Ooh, oh, that's so cool. It's a freaking switch and the dragon's mouth. Can you get any more badass than that? I don't know. Probably. I mean, if there's 10 switches in the dragon's mouth, and that would be pretty cool. All right. Let's use the iron boots here. So we're actually on, like, this platform here. I don't know what exactly the point is of this. Uh, let's find out. Is this going to lower the water? Whoa, you can, like, there's, like, there's, like, blah, blah, blah. there's, like, no water in his mouth. You can see the water currents going around his mouth. That's probably more glitchy than anything. You're probably just going to have water around the switch or some crap. I don't know. Is that timed? Of course it is. Alright. Oh no, there's no way. There's no way. <laughs> I did it! Wait, is there anything down there? Probably not. This is probably just a death trap. Why am I doing this for? What a terrible, terrible, terrible idea. Ha ha ha! Oh no, there's not here! Oh jeez! Oh man. Uh, well, we can't use our sword down here, so this is kind of an issue. Can we, can we hook shot them to death? Show me your mouth. Oh no, you have to use it twice! Right, I'm ready this time. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Let's see through the wall. Are you just stuck? Hello? There we go. Jeez. What an asshole. I'm just waiting patiently for him. But he's just like, yeah, you can, you can go, man. I don't care. I think there's one more, but it went through the gate, I think. I don't really know, to be honest. All right, what is up here? There is nothing up here. I don't know what that switch is for. Probably opens the gate down there. We got a key. A small key, in fact. Smaller than my dinky. Ha, man, I'm filled with all the jokes today. I am so funny. I'm so funny. Listen to my funny jokes. Why am I becoming Arnold all of a sudden? I don't know. All right, let's just go through. That was that was terrible. I didn't even, like, I just stopped doing it because I'm like, well, this is really dumb. I stopped doing it forever. Oh no, okay, we gotta go around. We're going around. One more bend, there we go. The door is over here! There we go. Whew! I don't think I'd make it actually. Why is this hookshot target up there? Is there anywhere we could reach it from? Ooh. What that room? For some reason, I don't think we're gonna reach that yet, unless I freaking ate the Gomu <laughs> <Go -mo> food. <coughs> Excuse me. Excuse me, princess. Yeah, let's say the Gomu Gomu fruit and then I can like stretch my arms, yeah, that's what I'm trying to say, but I guess all I really need to see is the Gomu Gomu fruit and whoever would understand it would understand and whoever wouldn't understand would just go, okay, I don't understand that joke, I give up. But now that I keep talking around, people are like, what the heck is this Gomu Gomu fruit thing? I have to Google it and then now you're Googling it and now you're just like, oh, it's One Piece, what the heck, why, why, why? And then I just be like, well, because it's actually a pretty funny show and by funny I mean it's a pretty good show and an even better manga. True facts, bros. Oh no, I forgot! I have made a terrible mistake. Oh, you have made a terrible mistake. Alright, can you use my hook shot? Yeah, it's kind of annoying. You have to like use your hook shot like from the bottom of the water. Like, I kept saying like there. I felt like a teenage girl for a second there. Spoilers, I am a teenage girl. Haha! <sighs> <laughs> Okay, now, have we already gone this way? Have you ever heard the wolf cry to the blue corn? Oh! Well, how do you like that? I don't actually like it, like, at all. Um, what am I looking for? Let's try the Megaton hammer. I mean, it's clear that the, uh... What the heck? Really? It's clear the bombs will destroy that, but shouldn't the Megaton hammer as well? It's a freaking Megaton. I don't even know how much a Megaton weighs. I don't know how much a ton weighs. I don't know how much a Megaton weighs. Isn't Mega like a thousand or something? No, that's kilo. I, I, I don't know. I feel like Mega can actually be like referred to as a certain measurement, but I'm not, I don't know. I actually don't know. Probably not actually come to think of it. That's probably stupid. Oh, my good lord! I don't know why I took my shield! When I had a clear shot at you, this asshole. Open your mouth. Open your mouth. Surprise! What? I pressed left. No, I lost my opportunity. Come on, asshole. Open your mouth. You have to like move. What the fudgios? Come on, really? You have to like move for it to notice you. Oh, hi. What the? F 
Really? Come on, really? Come on, am I hitting the wall? I'm actually hitting the wall. There we go. <sighs> I could have just swam past them, but screw that. You messed up with the wrong Chris. Oh man, you could probably hear all the saliva in my mouth. Like, <sighs> that's the one really bad thing about having a swell up tongue. Well, actually, there's a multiple. There's a lot of things that are bad with having a swell up tongue. It's like I have a lot more saliva in my mouth, so it's like. <sighs> Uh, is this timed? This might be timed. Is it timed? No. Okay, interesting. It's a dragon! Did we, I didn't get to show you guys that. Crap. Uh, if the water goes back down, then maybe we'll show you guys that. That thing! I believe we're about to come up to our first cool treasure over here. And if you listen closely, you can hear it! Uh, did it switch to this gate though? Whatever shall we do? Oh no! I actually like this puzzle. It's pretty clever. You gotta... Yeah, wait. Yeah, spin attack! When your energy goes through the gate. I think that's kind of a silly puzzle, though. It's like, that's kind of like a game breaking mechanic puzzle. But it's cool, but it's still kind of weird. And there we go. Ooh, you can see a big man skirt. It's a kilt! It's not a man skirt, it's a kilt! Oh, I'm sorry, Link. I didn't need to insult your man dress. <laughs> okay, um. Yay, is that, is that really all that was in here? A sculpture limita? Apparently, Chris. Apparently. So, does this water ever go back down? Does this affect the entire dungeon or just this room? Is there anything behind here? I think that would have been clever for Nintendo to do. Once you go to that room, you get this question like, Oh, I'm done in here. I guess I'm just going to go back. And they actually hit something behind this pillar. But no, they didn't take the opportunity. I almost feel like they, that's almost too perfect of a spot. I almost feel like they were going to do that and they started against it. I decided to put like a sculpture uh, somewhere else or something. I was gonna say a sculpture or a heart piece. There's only sculptures in here or in any temple, which is weird. I, don't, I wonder why they didn't put any heart pieces in any of the temples. But you know, what? I kind of like that. It gives it gives them more room to place like other th like the heart pieces around the world, make it a bigger world than just having all your treasures like sculptures and heart pieces all in like the temples and stuff and stuff. Alright, this is the room I was in. This is where Princess Naruto is. Or was. So that means we've done we've done all the things in here. So yay. We can come up here and use the walk key. Yay! And go to the center room that a lot of people don't even notice at first, including myself, because it's like, whoa! I didn't realize there's a middle place in there and oh my god, you know, there's freaking things up there. Alright, let's go. Yeah. And I feel there's a sculpture in here. Ooh, interesting. Very interest. Do I want to do that? I don't really know. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> I sound so amazed. Ooh, there's a sculpture up there. Let's bypass that for now, I guess. Maybe. Should I not bypass it for now, I guess? <gasps> oh, actually, that's, I was, that's terrible, but it's really kind of not. It's a sniffing sound. What is that noise? I don't freaking know. Whatever. I, I don't care to find out. Quite frankly, I'd, I'd be kind of scared to find out. Uh, is there anything this way? No. Oh, yes. I can hook shot up here. But is there anything up here? I don't remember. I remember being up here. Oh, no. I made a terrible choice. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. I can clearly climb, climb, climb up there. Totally climb up there. Ah, what a perfect example of how terrible my tongue is right now. Terrible tongue, terrible tongue. I don't know tongue twisters work right now. Sally sees seashells by the seashore. There is nothing up here. I've already completed this room. Good lord. Oh no, we're gonna do this crap again. Good lord, Link. So poopy. <clears throat> okay, there's nothing in here anymore, Chris. I gotta cross this room off my list of rooms to go through. <sighs> there's, there's probably gonna be a lot of that in this temple, to be honest, guys. Like, I'm already starting to lose track of what rooms I've completed and which rooms I have not. Oh, I guess I gotta light that torch to go back in there. What? Okay, I was clearly too late for that. Alright, can't do anything about that door because there's no platform below it. <gasps> Holy crap, that scared me. Okay, you, it looks like we could do something with that for now, but we can't do something with that for now. Furry now. Alright, we can't do anything here. We could go through the bottom again. We're gonna take a shortcut here and just use this fire. All right, what do you want, Navi? Oh, yeah. I, as soon as I pressed it, I was like, oh yeah, she's gonna tell me the strong arm falls and I can't go through that. Very clearly. But yeah, just light the torch and there we go. We're on our way. 
Tell everybody I'm on my way. New friends and new places to see. Alright, so. What do you say about this, Navi? Uh. To those who wish, open the gate on the fair heights. Okay, on the fair heights. What, what the heck fair heights are you talking about? Oh, JC, that speedrun Zelda's lullaby. Dang, sucker. I'm so quick. They call me Quickster. Yeah. Huh. My question is, did you guys see that? I'm out of magic. Holy crap. What? I should probably start breaking jars, to be honest. <laughs> Oops, nope, I didn't want to use that actually. Nope, I want to iron boot it, it up. Uh, for those with the keen eyes would see that there's a room under here that only shows up when you use the song because there's a block blocking it. Block blocking it. <laughs> <clears throat> okay, so let's go through here. Hmm. Clever Nintendo. But I won't fall for your poise! So I actually do remember this part about this temple. I was like, hey, there's a switch in the middle of the room in this empty room. <laughs> but if you actually hit it, can you not hit that from here? Really? Jesus, it has terrible range. Man, I wish it was longer or something. You hit the switch, and holy crap, all this crap comes through the ceiling. It's like, dude, I actually kind of don't want to deal with it. I was going to do... Oh, we have to deal with it. Well, then, okay, fine, then. Oh, my good lord. Okay, let's take care of these spikes first. Oh, dude, we can't! Watch out! Can we kill with our hook? Yes, we can. Yes, yes we can. Well, as long as they don't move, I don't think they're gonna even know we're here, so it's kind of cheaty, but whatever. I don't care. I'm a gangster, you know what I mean? I'm a gangster. I eat these with my teeth. Yay! I will get you out if I'm farther away, where you can't see me for some reason. But you know, I'll take it. Right, pull that out. There we go. I was gonna say, can you not? Dude! Dude! I don't want that! <laughs> Dude, what? You guys saw it, it like, went inside of his body! No, the other one. Good lord. Get loud. There we go. Good boy. Now, there we go. Was that so difficult? Apparently, because I had a lot of trouble with it. And now let's get above us a bit. Is there any magic over there? There might have been, but, you know, I probably would have um, been long gone because I wasn't paying attention. Can I go through here? Oh, I can. Okay. Super. <laughs> Uh, I believe where those enemies are that's just like it's just literally a holding cell for the enemies so there's nothing in there it's just a dead end it's just a D and I believe that's it for here correct let's take a look let's take a look at this book that's actually a map where are we all right all righty then mid jump we're gonna change it change our boots <laughs> Hmm. Good boy, Link. I feel like I'm doing pretty well so far. But I kind of feel like I felt like I was doing really well the first time I tried this temple. And then I was stuck in it for hours once I ran out of keys or something. Yeah, see, it's just a holding cell. I remember when I very, very first started Let's Playing, I made a promise to myself that if there's anything I ever wanted to see in a game, but I didn't go to see it based on, like, oh, but then that'll be a big waste of time in my Let's Play. I decided I'm not going to be like one of those Let's Players that says, I wonder what... Yeah, okay, hold on, let me, let me iterate, iliter I can't say that word. <laughs> let me word that a bit better there. Um, I feel like a lot of Let's Players say stuff like, Oh, that place would be so cool to walk to. But I'm not going to do it because it will take too much time. I hate when people do that. Because it's like, well, what's the point of let's play a game and showcase a game if you don't show everything, you know, you want to see and show off everything, like, you know, is awesome, right? Even though, I mean, the argument might be, well, this, this is a big waste of time because there's going to be nothing over there. I mean, that that's kind of silly in my opinion because it's like, well, you want to see what's over there, so go see what's over there. All right, now I'm trying to remember which room it is. Oh, actually, I do know which room it is. Uh, not that one. <clears throat> To waste the least amount of time, I'm trying to 
figure out which way to jump down. Is it over here? Did I really just do like three laps around this thing for nothing? It is right here. Okay. So, I think there's a key down here that maybe is the one I forgot about last time I played this and got stuck. And if it is, then that would be pretty great. And I could have just used Furore's Wind, actually. I'm just thinking about that right now, but at this point, there's no point because I remember. I remember! And we float up. We floating up, 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 we're floating up, 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 we're floating up, 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 we're on fire! So, last time we saw this place, it was underwater and we couldn't get to it. But now we can finally get to it, and it's pretty fantastic, and it's a giant crack in the wall, and it's freaking cool. Okay, let's use bomb on it. Let's use a boom on it. Let's use a boom on it. Yeah, this one's really freaking forgettable, because you only see it for a split second. This is a key, right? What if there's like 20 rupees? Or 5 rupees to be even more funny? Ha ha ha! Man, I'm funny. <laughs> okay. Uh, is there a hookshot target up here? Out of pure curiosity's sake. Is there any way to get up there from there? Nope, doesn't look like. Okay. Okay. I wish I had the Zora's tunic here. I wish you could just, like, swim down freely forever. Five ever, you know, yo, bro. Because I just... It, I, I really like how they did the water controls in the Zoro tunic in Skyward Sword. You can just swim through the water forever. You don't have to freaking put on iron boots. I think that's the only reason why I hate this so much. Because you have to put on freaking iron boots all the time. Iron freaking boobs. Well, let's look at a map. And I'm sorry, I keep going to my map, then going off, and going to my map, and going off. Alright, it looks like there's a... S hmm. I'm trying to look at the rooms that we could go into that will lead us to like the second floor or something. Because that's where the water level is at right now. So... I don't really know to be honest. So at this point where I'm kind of not sure where to go. Uh, I think this was really just the collecting keys phase of the dungeon and I think three keys is enough. I'm not 100% on that though. Which kind of worries me because- Oh, there's this door over here! Okay, great. Thank the load. Because I was really starting to get a bit nervous. Right? I'm like, oh no, where do I go from here? Oh no. Oh no! Alright. Um, I also feel like I'm missing sculptures. There's five sculptures in here, by the way. And I've only gotten one so far, and I did not do that right. Well, poop. Yeah, when you go in the water when it's already up, it just kind of pushes you out. As a geyser would, and it'd probably be a lot more painful than what Link is putting on right now. It's like he's just kind of having fun. He's like, "Wee!" But in reality, water that could push you up is probably really powerful. Oh yeah, there's this asshole <laughs> that tricks you every time. He tricks, he tricks you. Holy crap! He took off a lot of hurts for me. What a silly, simple tech fight. I don't have a fairy, so do I really need an arrow for this? Of course I do. <sighs> Well, at least Nintendo does a good job in this game at, like, making you use all your items. Uh, so far, anyways. Uh, there we go. I need it! It's me, boy, can I can jump off. Oh, no! What the heck? Uh, I don't know what just happened there, but I'll take it, I guess. I'll take it up the bomb. Wait, what? Right, let's go through the door. Let's go through the door! Ooh. Um, I guess I want to do this. I don't really know, to be honest. Oops. <laughs> Let's try it again. Dude! Dude! I'm just trying to speed run. Yeah! <laughs> Close enough. Uh, what I would see let's play with this, I would see people put fours wind up here. Sorry, that was a stretch by the way. I wasn't constipated. No worries there. Um, yeah, I'd see people use fours wind there, but I mean, I haven't used fours wind on the other one yet, so I don't really think I should or something. I'm not really sure. I don't know. Dude, can you stop hitting the wall? I'm trying to freaking turn toward. Dude, this freaking sneaky ass tech tight. What an asshole. Okay, we're gonna call an episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. This episode of Let's Play SpongeBob SquarePants Battle for Beauty. Wait, what? That's weird. It looks like there should be a door here, but there isn't. In the next episode, we'll maybe get close to finishing the dungeon. I think it'll probably take maybe one more episode after this to finish us up, including the boss, maybe? Or maybe that's a gross underestimation and it'll actually take forever. 
Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.